Vlog number 345, Stephen Wilson, The Future Bites. I just bought my first CD of 2021. These days I don't buy as many CDs as I used to. I, I purchased Stephen Wilson, The Future Bites. I've gotten real into Stephen Wilson in the last couple of years. I remember I was taking a walk and I had my headphones on listening to Pandora. And I was listening to... Um, a progressive rock station on Pandora plays a lot of Genesis and Pink Floyd and stuff that I like. And then uh, they played this song, Drive Home, which I never heard before. And I had to go to my device and uh, see who did it in the, in the title and everything. And I was blown away by it. So, uh, so I checked out a lot of other Stephen Wilson stuff and I liked everything I listened to. So... Uh, Stephen Wilson started his musical career with a band called Porcupine Tree in England. Porcupine Tree was a hard rock band mixed with some progressive elements. And then Stephen Wilson went on his own, and his solo career has mostly been progressive rock. The new album, The Future Bites, that I just bought, is more of a pop album, but still has progressive elements. Now, he's been around a while. He's actually 53 years old. Um, if I were to recommend an album to buy from him, I would buy The Raven That Refused to Sing and Other Stories. It's two CDs. It's excellent. So if you like progressive rock, you like bands like Yes and Genesis and Pink Floyd, you probably would like this. So anyway, that's the end of today's vlog. Everybody stay safe.